All right, number one, we want to complete the sentence below. So this is one of those first definitions, the properties that we saw um, when we deal with log. So we have log base A of one equals what? And we will put an X here. So um, if you change this to exponential form, this becomes your base. So you have one equals A to the X power. And then we can write this as a to the zero power, because anything to the zero power except for zero is equal to one. And then we can see that um, this would be equal to zero. X would be equal to zero in this case. So that's just one of the properties. Um, but that's, this is the way that you would kind of show that um, using rewriting exponential notation. And then um, this one, we will also complete this statement. So this is another one of those properties. So I'll kind of work it out so you can see we have A um, raised to the power log base A of M. Okay, so if your base is A and you're taking the log base A, these kind of cancel each other out, like that cancellation property. So when that happens, okay, so that and that will cancel each other out, you will be just left with M. Okay, so that's pretty much the idea that you want to see there. Um, they cancel each other out. And also, number three, almost the same property but they just have it in different forms so this was exponential form and the other one number three is in log form so we have log base a and we're taking the log of a to the power of r so again this um, base a log and a here cancel each other out the whole thing and you're just left with r so that's the property there that they want you to be familiar with.